Oh, hi! I'm done with my internship. Yesterday was my last day at the Smithsonian Science Education Center, and now I'm getting ready to head home, as evidenced by the bare walls behind me. I am extremely thankful for my time at the Smithsonian. When I got the call offering me the internship, I had been repeatedly checking my phone for hours, and I was so excited, and I really didn't know what to expect, but the little I did expect, the Smithsonian has entirely blown out of the water. A little background about my internship. I worked in the publications division of the Smithsonian Science Education Center. We're not a museum, but we're the only formal education unit within the Smithsonian, and we produce hands-on curriculum that's used in classrooms for about 6 million students worldwide. Now, the thing about the Smithsonian is that, contrary to popular belief, it's more than just museums. The Smithsonian actually encompasses 19 museums, the National Zoo, and countless research centers around America and worldwide. There's also an educational unit like the SSAC, where I worked. One of the coolest things about my job was to see that my work actually had an impact. Like, on the first day, my boss joked that I wouldn't be fetching coffee or anything, but it was amazing to see how the things I wrote, the videos I made, the feedback I gave, were actually used within the organization. On a normal week, I would do anything from writing blog posts, to producing videos, to giving feedback on our apps and games, to developing YouTube strategy and writing posts for social media. And it was great! Like, the blog posts I wrote will actually be published over the coming months, and a promo video I made will actually be helpful, and the feedback for the apps and games actually affects the kind of products we release. It's been a summer of actually doing things. There's just something really special about that, like that this huge, worldwide, well-known institution will take on interns and not have them do menial things, but will say, we want you. We want your skills. How, how can we learn from you? How can you help us? That's just great! Now, you can also tell when I start breaking away from my video script, because I get super excited about things. Anyway, even beyond a normal week, the people I got to interact with and the special events I got to attend were just absolutely incredible. My boss and the rest of the staff were so kind and supportive, and I loved getting to go to our science teacher conferences. With those, I went with teachers from all over the country to the Smithsonian Environmental Research Center, the headquarters for NOAA, the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, the Carnegie Institute of Washington, behind the scenes of the Natural History Museum. It was fantastic. I got to learn from and interact with leading scientists at the leading edge of their field, and pretty much the entire time I was just internally geeking out. And even beyond that, my boss was so flexible in letting me go to things that would help me professionally, like resume workshops or the Pluto flyby, things I would have never had a chance to do without this internship. So getting to the title of the video, Should You Intern for the Smithsonian? I think I've made it pretty clear. But yes, absolutely. Whether you're interested in history, art, finance, new media, research, curriculum development, you name it, there's probably a place for you at the Smithsonian. You'll be treated with dignity and respect, you'll get to do work that actually makes a difference and has an impact, and you'll get to work with some of the most helpful and genuine people who really just want to see you succeed. In short, this internship has been more than I could have ever imagined. I came in with no published writing, and I'm leaving having written or helped write nine articles, two videos, a pilot for an animated children's series, content for a video game, so many things. <laughs> I'll leave links in the description to all of my work that's been published so far, but even more than that, I really encourage you to follow the Smithsonian Science Education Center on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, whatever social media you're on. They are doing incredible work and they deserve a lot of love. I'll also leave links to all of their pages down in the description as well. For now though, it's time to keep packing and go on a few last walks around DC for the summer. Where did the last 10 weeks go? As always, I'm really excited to bring you guys more content in the future and I look forward to sharing thoughts and awesome science in the weeks to come. See you soon!